You gonna lie on my pussy? Bitch, you lying on my fucking pussy? When you lie about my pussy, I'ma sue you. And you gotta come with receipts. And not only not social media receipts, you gotta come with court receipts. Cause one thing you're gonna you're not gonna do, you're not gonna lie on my pussy, and you're not gonna lie about me stepping out on my shit. She talking about good luck, you think I'm Tasha K. Like I said, bitch. Lying on my pussy, bitch, will get you sued. And I will get every little fucking red penny that you ever fucking make, bitch. Any money, every money that you make off your publishing, bitch. So, find something safe to do, bitch. You and you want to talk about you, you not Tasha K. You're right. Ask Tasha K. She tried, when, when she tried to lie that shit on me, what happened? Ask her. Ask her. You're not Tasha K, bitch. You're actually fucking dumb. But for you to lie on my pussy, and you know what's so crazy? Even before... I put out this remix and shit. You was trying to go around and tell niggas to get close to my nigga to put that lie about me. Now, like I said, you could diss me. We could go battle for battle. Hey, Mary, that new nigga fucking on you. I tell him school. Are you mad at cheating on you? Bitch, tell him the truth. I'm getting ahead in the challenge. I'm telling people that it's close to my nigga that I'm fucking on niggas. And... I thought that it was somebody trying to be messy, trying to start some shit between me and you. But now that I see the, t the fake diss record that you trying to put out, that was you all along. You could come at me at any angle. Hey sippers, welcome back to a crazy gossip video. So honey, I am so petrified at this point because Cardi B, you know, like you have kids of course, and you're married, but you, this is what you do on social media. You're like one of those top female rappers and this is what you do. And yet, a lot of people love to drag Nikki that oh Nikki's on drugs. But this is how Cardi B behaves and it is somewhat accepted, honey. Can't even formulate a proper sentence, okay? And you hinting that you're gonna sue a person like honey, Bia didn't mention your name honey and if Bia were to say bitch is bitch on your birth certificate as your name how are you gonna sue someone who referred to you as a biatch honey the intimidation is real honey and if you're so happy and so glorious that you're celebrating suing a black woman like tasha k though tasha was wrong like honey wrap it up because you've done a lot of mess that you had to pay your way out of honey cardi b went to court because of course there were lawsuits against her okay so you're not a saint you can't formulate a proper sentence you actually trying to intimidate bia and then calling the girl dumb honey that doesn't make any sense because bia no you can't sue her because bia did not mention your name yet you want to call her dumb like be for real that's real comedy you're calling someone dumb who didn't mention your name However, you're calling them dumb because you're assuming that you could sue them because they're lying on your punani, girl. When did Bia ever mention your name in a song? And then you want to imply that Bia is dumb? Wrap this up. First of all, this is what happens when people allow just anybody to enter the music industry. I'm not saying, you know, Cardi B shouldn't have been successful. I'm just saying this is ratchet behavior. Like, this is crazy. At this point, her husband, Offset, you know, I love Offset as a rapper. But I'm starting to wonder, like, what is you doing with Cardi B? Like, hmm, is Cardi B affecting Offset's reputation. Some people would say, you know what? Offset is Cardi B's karma, you know, because she can't get a rest. Everybody's talking about Offset doing this and doing that. And she want to allegedly sue everybody who mentions Offset and some cheating rumors. I'd be for real, girl. You're a woman. Put out that album. Focus on your goals, honey. You doing this back and forth makes you look bothered. And and then Cardi B want to say, Bia is not interested. You know, I don't care about you. I don't look at you. Uh, I don't like your music. I don't. I don't like the way you look. First of all, Bia 
is gorgeous very very beautiful okay so i feel like uh as nikki said the fact that cardi is disgusted someone looks is very funny like cardi shouldn't have been a person who's discussing anybody looks not that i'm calling cardi b anything okay but i just feel like bia is a natural beauty the lady is gorgeous and let me tell you something bia writes her raps and bia is naturally talented i feel like a lot of people would say cardi b is delusional or the, the surgery that she did is getting to her head i don't know sweetheart but cardi b is pure comedy because how are you gonna call mona lisa least interesting honey bia is drop dead gorgeous i don't know what type of bubble cardi b is living in sweetheart but uh Y'all need to stop dragging Nikki that she's doing drugs. Y'all need to stop. Because when Nikki defends herself, it's a problem. Now Cardi B coming on rants. First of all, Bia is not even responding, honey. Bia is at the Bad Boys for Life premiere posting her celebration. She was enjoying her moment at the Bad Boys for Life premiere. And mind you, Bia has a song on the bad boy for life movie track okay so i'm very excited for that so the girl is making moves and carter b is making rants listen this is all a mess honey but let us know what you guys think about the situation let me see those comments and see you guys next time and thank you for sipping with us